Welcome to my channel. Please subscribe now. The Elantra GT's base four-cylinder displaces 2.0 liters, like the sedan standard engine, but different tuning results in 162 horsepower versus the sedan's 147. Both six-speed manual and six-speed automatic transmissions are offered with this naturally aspirated engine. Things get more interesting in the Elantra GT Sport, which packs the Elantra Sport sedan's turbocharged 1.6-liter form making 201 horses and 195 pounds to foot of to work. Here, too, a six-speed manual comes standard, while the optional automatic is a seven-speed dual-clutch unit. All Elantras are front-wheel drive. As in the sport sedan, the GT Sport swaps out the standard to Warshan beam rear suspension for an independent multi-link setup. 18-inch wheels and larger brakes round out the changes to the performance-oriented model. No matter the trim level, the Elantra GT's interior looks upscale and sensibly laid out, with the dashboard design noticeably different from the sedans. An 8.0-inch display screen comes standard and offers Apple CarPlay and Android Auto functionality along with an updated version of Hyundai's Blue Link infotainment software. As with any hatchback, cargo carrying practicality is an important consideration. The Elantra GT's cargo hold boasts 25 feet 3 of space, which is between the Golf's 23 and the Civic hatchback's 26. With the 60-40 split rear seats folded, the Elantra provides 55 feet 3 of space, beating out both of those rivals, the Honda provides 46, while the Golf is 53. The 2018 Elantra GT will reach dealerships this summer and is likely to be priced starting around $20,000. That's higher than the Elantra sedan's $17,985 base price but the GT will try to justify its higher price using its enhanced practicality and style.